Hey, what is going on, guys? It's Lachlan here, back with a brand new episode of the Pixelmon Gotta Catch Them All series, guys, episode 24. And today, guys, is April Fools. Now, I was gonna do a joke today for you guys, but uh, lots of people have already done it today, like including like, Google Maps and stuff. So I didn't really want to do it because everybody would know straight away, and if they didn't, then they would get scared. But uh, yeah, happy April Fools! I am a white-robed villager today. Uh, that's my skin, as you view. Don't know, uh, Mojang pretty much made everybody like a type of villager for April Fools, which is a pretty cool joke, and I mean, I got the pretty swag one, I got like white robes, and I look pretty cool, but I gotta tell you, it's pretty funny playing like Hunger Games on the Nexus and like everybody's a villager, it's pretty sick, but uh, yeah, anyway, welcome back to another episode, episode 24. Uh, last episode, guys, we caught ourselves a mute, it was quite a cool episode, highly suggest you check that one out. And uh, yeah, just a little reminder that if you do enjoy the Gotta Catch Them All series, be sure to support the episode with a like. It's really great to have all of your feedback and stuff like that. And to get a nice little amount of likes on the episode is always great as well. But uh, anyways, uh, taking down this Raticate straight off the bat who just wants to fight me every time. Uh, but we got Porygon too, yo. So yeah, the goal of today is to get Bayleaf up to a Meganium. Uh, we got him from a Chikorita up yesterday. Uh, I also killed a boss off screen. Put my armor back on so you can see my villager face. Uh, now, yep, uh, we got this light screen TM. I just got it. It was. I wanted to save the boss for when I started recording, but I was like, it's only a green, and I got like the worst TM anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Um, so, yeah, let's go on our Charizard and let's try and get some new Pokemon. So, I am hoping to catch, uh, I think, five every episode is my goal uh, for each episode just to make sure I'm making progress with the series and stuff like that. Obviously, exclusions for things like shinies and, uh, oh, what the hell is that? Shinies and legendaries because they're obviously a lot harder to catch. And getting them off the list just makes my job so much easier to catch them all. Um, so there's a soul rock. I don't believe I've caught a soul rock yet. Uh, like I said last episode, I water, soda water, soda water, soda water, is soda water in the pick? No, it's not. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I'm trying to, like, phase them out one by one. Uh, knocking these guys out. Uh, Solar Rock, we haven't caught that one, so let's catch him. Because we got enough Pokeballs now to catch a lot of these dudes. X is a jeez, man. It's gonna kill him. Knew it! Ugh! You could, uh, why you do this, Solar Rock? Because Solar Rock's one of those Pokemon that come out at night. No, come out during the day, and then the Lunatone comes out at night, which I think is really, really cool. Uh, Milk Tank. Let's try to catch a Milk Tank. I tried to catch one of these guys last time, and it just was not happening. Like, it just, just wasn't happening at all. Um, but I got a sort of a few little announcements for you guys this episode. Uh, it's it's not really uh, like the best news. Well, it's good news because uh, for those of you who guys who like Pixelmon Island, I got some good news for you. That series is I'm gonna say it will start in April, and if it doesn't, then something's really bad because it will start in April. Uh, but the only bad news is that we've got if we start Pixelmon Island season two. Look at this milk tank chomping all my great balls up. Um, we're gonna have too many Pixelmon series, so what I've decided to do is when Pixelmon Island starts for the- Oh, come on, Milk Tank. Yes, that was so annoying to catch. 20% complete. Yeah, buddy, we're almost there. Like, not really, but yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're gonna be putting, I think, when Pixelmon Island starts, I think we're gonna be putting, uh, the Gotta Catch Em All series on a slight hold. Now, I wanna get your feedback on this, because I think three Pixelmon series is way too much. Have I caught an Aaron yet? I don't think I have. Um, see, so yeah, I want your, your opinions there because I want to keep Kanto as my, uh, every now and then because that's not a daily series. That's like a once every two days because I like to edit it pretty well and take my time with that series because I really do enjoy playing the Kanto server. Um, Aaron, why would you do that? Get in the Pokeball, buddy. He's going to keep roaring me and that's not going to be fun for any of us. Don't roar, don't roar, don't roar. Come on, come on. I need a better attack than, uh, hey, let's just try a great ball straight up, and if that doesn't work, then we'll, we'll go a little in-depth, um, I think I might have to start with a, oh, come on, just catch it, Aaron, make it easy, I, oh, there's another one of those soul rocks over there, all right, let's eat some steak while we're here, but, uh, yeah, I'd just like to get your feedback on that, because three Pixelmon series just can't be happening at the same time, so I'm gonna put this one on hold for when I, uh, take on Pixelmon Island, which is gonna be really fun, I hope you guys are getting excited for that one, there's gonna be a lot of interaction with you guys, on that series I'm trying to plan out, but uh, yeah, so that's just something I want to ask you, uh, this little episode, um, but uh, let's try and catch this Soul Rock now, because he is a cheeky little one, um, and he looks really good this update, i got to say, uh, let's try Night Slash, well, that we're just murdering all the Soul Rocks today, damn it, 
I, I wish I could fly sizzle just so it makes things easier. But that's not going to be happening. Uh, we've caught two Pokemon so far. Milk Tank and Aron. Uh, and then I want to try and get a fossil machine going. Oh, okay guys. We're going to try and catch a Beldum. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to go heal up, then maybe catch a Beldum. Because I need to paralyze these guys. But anyone who has ever played Pixelmon before, they will know that trying to catch a Beldum is almost impossible. It's so hard to catch these guys. If we catch one, like, that'll be the series right there, because these guys are so annoying. It's honestly worth throwing a Master Ball at them, and they're that hard. Um, so let's try and do it. Unless they've changed the rates, but I'm pretty sure they haven't, because in traditional... Uh, the only way you really attain them in Pokemon is, like, in that Ruby Sapphire house. Um, after you beat the game, or the Elite Four, I think. So he's really hard to catch. Alright. Um, they also have that move that kills himself, so they have Takedown... So if I false swipe him, he'll use takedown and then kill himself. See? He didn't kill himself though. That was weird. Um, Alright, Pokeball and Ultra Ball. Just to test the waters here. I'm pretty sure normally it's an it's an insta pop. Um, he's in the Yeah, yeah. See, like these guys, they're a nightmare to work with. They're really just not fun. They yeah, uh, I'm not looking for He's not killing himself though, which makes this so much easier. It looks like takedown's glitched and he's not taking recoil. I'm happy with that one. I'll take it. Um, so yeah, let's try, uh, Ultra Ball now, he's paralyzed, 1 HP, he's level 5, Instapop, like this guy right here, I remember I caught one, uh, in my actual series a while ago, and it took a long time, oh my god, but, and he's killed himself, Jesus Christ, Belden, why, ugh, that, that right there, what well, makes me QQ every time, um, let's, is that a Pokeloot, no, that's a, oh, there's a Solrock, let's try that one again. What up to the other Beldum? Did he just disappear? I think he did. Oh, well. That's a little sad. Um, so, yeah. There's a Solrock over here. Um, guys, for today, there's going to be a special second upload. Uh, something different. No way. It's level Aaron. Gonna... Really? An Aaron took him down? Jesus. All right. Um, so, yeah. What was I saying? Uh, yeah. There's going to be a really cool uh, new thing coming out today. It's going to be like a... Hopefully today, at least. Um, I just spoke to Wuffles, who went to bed. And when he, when he wakes up, we're going to get it going. Um... I'm not going to catch a Butterfree, actually, I just realized. I'm going to catch a Caterpie and then level it up from there because there's no point in uh, just getting that. That's just a waste of Pokeballs, really. So let's try and catch some of these bug Pokemon, I guess. Um, Caterpie. Have I caught a Caterpie? Really? Why is all the Pokemon fighting each other? It's like the first Pokemon movie all over again. Everybody's fighting each other. What's the bet they're string-shotting each other and using, like, uh, come on. Which is the better Caterpie? I want it. That one. You're mine. <laughs> uh, I probably shouldn't even bother full swiping this dude. Uh, but, uh, yeah. So, I still want to get that Meganium as well. Uh, but I'm thinking I might just try and get all the bug Pokemon up. That might be a decent goal this episode. That'll be a lot of Pokedex entries for me as well. Um, so, I might just go ahead and do that, actually. So, let's get him in here. Uh, nice and snuggled up in our little Great Ball. And he's captured up. Uh, so, let's go over here to the Poke Center because I want to access my PC. Damn it, i got to go across the river. I wish I would surf. I QQ every time. Oh, look! It's Billy! What are you doing, Billy? Is he following us? What are you doing? Jimmy? Get, yeah, that's right. You get the hell out of here, dude. What what kind of AI is that? Like, go to the nearest water and then, like, get out? Like, <laughs> don't even know what's going on there. Um, so there's that movie we caught last episode. I actually haven't uh, brought him out yet because there's really no point until we get the machine for Mewtwo. Um... Uh, let's see here. Who can I get rid of? I'll get rid of you and put you there. And do I, I think I have a Weedle. From memory, I have a Weedle in here somewhere. Uh, let's see. Weedle, 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 Weedle. I don't think I have a Weedle. I still got to level up that shiny Geodude as well. Get that new uh, start. There's Weedle. Um, he looks different than he used to be. Just me. <laughs> I'm going to swap him with Porygon. And uh, we'll get... Whoa, getting them hiccups. Doing a pedestal. Getting all the hiccups. Um, and then we'll go back to our house and go to bed because it's getting really dark outside and I don't know where all the bosses be at because depth perception and stuff. Uh, Rattata's taken on the wild magic Magikarps. So that's not very fun. And we're on the Lake of Rage. Um, any Dratinis for me? Oh, there's a Dratini! Yeah, buddy! Alright, okay, okay. That was great. Ask and you shall receive. Okay, now I'm not going to mess this one up. I swear. False swipe. Oh, I nearly hit Night Slash and I just would have QQ'd so bad. And I will put this guy to Paralyze because he's a little tricky one to catch. Uh, good old Dratini. He's not the easiest one 
in the in the in the lake to catch. Um, let's go Ultra Ball just to get it nice and sealed. And that should be a Dratini in the books as well. So I'm really happy with that one. Now I just need Dragonite to get that line all done and dusted. Um, really making some advances on that Pokedex today. Good episode. He popped. Not good. Get back in there, Dratini, buddy. We need you and you need us. You don't really need us, but just do it. <laughs> Come on. Um, it's just, it'll be good to have this. We got Dragonair pretty easily. Uh, Dratini should be easier. I think we got him. Yes, we got Dratini. Awesome. Nice work. Okay, let's get out of here. Preston, how you doing, buddy? Oh, even Preston is... Oh, that's what Preston's skin looks like right now. As Because he's a villager. How funny is that? They're actually, like, trading villagers right now. That's pretty funny. What's Mr. Wuffles like? Oh, Mr. Wuffles and these guys have black aprons, and I have a white uh, robe. So... Cool. I, I don't know. Maybe it works by country. That'd be really cool if it worked by country. Like, what color your villager was. That'd be really cool. Um, I don't even know why, but I'm just going to smack this guy. Because he's looking at me bad. Um, have we caught a Ledian? I'm not too sh We haven't caught a Ledian. Alright, let's uh, let's catch one. I can't be stuffed actually leveling one up. So, let's just catch one. Get him on the Pokedex. Uh, Scizor. Come in like a wrecking ball. False swipes, buddy. And... Didn't even get him down to one. That's a bit interesting. Uh, we'll go a Great Ball on this guy, I think. Stunned and... Uh, or Paralyzed and 1 HP. Should do pretty well on a Ledian, I think. Um, let's see, Sizzle. What are the, what's the verdict? There's a Mr. Mime in our house! No, quickly, we have to go get the Mr. Mime. He's running amok in our house. Look. I'm going to throw an Ultra Ball just to get this over and done with. There is literally a Mr. Mime in our house just running amok. And we need to go sort him out. Because it's not happening. It's just not happening. Look what they've done to my crops as well. They've broken up all my potatoes. A QQ Everton. All right, let's go get this Mr. Mime. Where is he? Oh, he's disappeared. Oh, he's a little cheeky one, Mr. Mime. He's come in and he said goodbye. You little cheeky one. He's just come in. Like, I saw him through the window while I was fighting that other dude. And he was, like, jumping up and down on my bed. I hope he doesn't, like hasn't like tampered with anything in my bed like that would be really creepy considering he's the creepiest pokemon ever in this game um anyway let's get right back up to leveling up caterpie because we still got to do that one uh so i'm pretty sure if i just try to battle that seeking switch out to even bay leaf to get that xp might be good um yeah if you want to just switch out to this guy just go x or that should kill him. That should get him us all the way up to a Butterfree. Can it do double evolutions? I've never seen that yet. Um, so here we go. Caterpie is evolving into a Metapod. And then hopefully... No, even in the game, they don't do double evolutions. It only works one at a time. So that would make sense. Uh, that's fair enough. It should upload... Upload? <laughs> it should digi-upload. What is this? It should evolve once. And then I need to battle again to re level it up, I think. Metapod. 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 I love uh, Metapod. <laughs> Alright, um, and then... The good thing about catching that Dratini is that every other Dratini now we can kill without being, like, mean. Have I caught a Pashorisu? I'm pretty sure I have. Oh, I hate it when they go under the leaves. That's the worst. So bad. Alright, Pashorisu. Let's see, buddy. You with us? Yeah, we've caught one of you, so we'll just X as you away. Alright, let's see some steak outside. Steak any steak, steaks to steak. Okay. Uh, Seeking, say hello to my Metapods, and then switch to Bayleaf. I want to see if Bayleaf can take down a Seeking. Uh, let's try Magical Leaf, then Razor Leaf. Uh, Magical Leaf, really bad. Let's try Synthesis, hopefully this is a- Dang it! Oh, not Weedle. Oh, actually, you know what? It would be smart to use Weedle, get them both up. Um, and then back out to Sizzle, and then we'll get both a Kakuna. Unless, can it do more than one of these at a time? I don't even know anymore. Weedle getting all that XP and levels. Okay, here we go. Metapod 2 Butterfree. Let's do it, buddy. Evolve. Getting lots of things. Well, I mean, like, these guys are really easy to get, so it's not, like, a major advancement. Like, it's it's a couple Pokedex entries, though. Definitely getting more than five today. Uh, that's really good. I wish we caught that Be Beldum, though. That would have been a huge relief. I honestly think at the end of the day, I'm going to end up using a... Uh, a Master Ball. And now Weedle's evolving, but the camera is very, very, like, not good. Uh, we've got a nice view of the Lake of Rage here. Very good. Uh, hopefully we get, like, a little nice Gyarados popping up. Uh, I don't know if it's spawning Lake Biomes, but 
that would be pretty cool, I guess, but it's not going to happen. Um, just looking out for Pokemon, I guess, right now, <laughs> while uh, Kakuna evolves awkwardly. And uh, let's get Kakuna up. So he's, I think we could kill Magikarp to get this one up, um, if we could find anything. Let's go on Preston's dock and see if we can find anything. Um, there's a Goldeen. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Let's just go Goldeen. Switch to Scizor, and then go for the X Scizor, which I seem to be using a lot lately. And then Kakuna in the water is going to evolve into a Beedrill. <laughs> uh, get out of the water, Kakuna. You're going to drown. Oh, my God. All right, here we go. Beedrill's coming into it. And there we go. We don't even get to see it evolve because we get a nice view of the dock. <laughs> and there's Beedrill. Beedrill just learned focus energy. Cool. Um, we can actually fly Beedrill. No. No, we can't fly Beedrill. I remember now. You can't fly Beedrill. Um, I remember it used to make me cry. You couldn't fly Beedrill. Um, have we caught a Pikachu? I think we have. Let's get this really small one. That'd make me happy. We haven't caught a Pikachu. All right, false swipes. Let's go, Pikachu. You're getting on our Pokedex today. Jam, we're absolutely killing it this episode with catches and just, just general Pokedex entries. Getting it up. Um, I think I need to go in the house, though, and go grab out my Pokedex to make sure that uh, I'm on the track here. But uh, these... Pikachu and the minimum seem to be having fun. Pluses, sorry. Uh, have I caught a pluses yet? I have. Okay, good. Because I remember there was one stage where I didn't have it. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I got all the Pikachu variants at this stage as well. Uh, Abra's found his way into my uh, place. And he's now going to die. Bye-bye. <laughs> uh, let's put all these away, I guess. These Pokemon now. Uh, they're on the Pokedex. Done and dusted. Don't no longer need Butterfree or Beedrill. They are done. So, bang and bang let's grab out uh there's a couple we could level up here as well um so what i put away i'll leave porygon holy crap ty you scared the crap out of me dude i thought you were like a player on the server just came in my house all right now that you're in my house we have to battle that's the rules of the the poke center it's the rules i don't make it look he's running he's running amok on my put get is this like a is this like an april fool's joke where you just like run on my house and just trample on everything like this is not okay I, I think i know why i made my iron sword now i know why i made it ah oh you can't kill trainers this update no dang it qq every time all right well let's just take him on then i guess uh let's grab out uh what should we grab out let's grab out look at these new catches we got damn um let's Actually, let's keep this guy. Let's not get Drapion. I'm not even going to teach him the move I was meant to teach him. Uh, Porygon 2, you can take this one out. So, Butterfree. Uh, I don't think he's Psychic type at this stage. So, we'll just use that. Oh, he confused us. Really? Ty, come on. We used to be... Oh, now we're paralyzed. That's the worst combo right there. Paralyzed and confused. It's so bad. All right. And a Scyther. He's got a nice legitimate bug team going. Not going to lie. Um, let's try and keep getting him. Another Scyther, eh? Another Scyther. Thinks he can take us down in our home, in our home, pretty much. That's what he's in. Come in here, evade. All right, this should do good because he's poison type. Uh, yep, that's a nice hit there. Another Butterfree, really? Come on. Oh, no, not that Sunspore. <sighs> he's running amok in my house. Just absolutely running amok. All right, and then... Confusion. Another Pokemon? Another Butterfree? Is that like three Butterfrees, man? Jesus. Porygon, do you think you can take this one out, please? I really should just switch to Charizard. He could have one-banged all these guys. Alright, victory. Let's heal up. <laughs> Jesus, that was so annoying. I don't know why that was so annoying. It just was. Um, Alright, now i got to keep this episode remotely short. I know my goal was to get Bayleaf up a little bit, but I think what I'm going to do is just get him up enough and... Because, I mean, like, we got all the bug Pokemon up, and that was good enough uh, on its own. So, let's just... Uh, I probably should level up another starter here. I'll get Piplup a couple starter levels as well. Maybe even get him up to a uh, Primplup. But, I uh, would like to focus on Bayleaf here. Try and get him up to around 30 before we end this episode off, and maybe catch a couple more Pokemon. I'm not too sure about that. We will see what happens. But, there's a Beached Magikarp. I think I already said that. Um... <laughs> Alright, uh, there's lots of trainers, man. These trainers have just come out to play today, I swear. Um, Namels, Radicates. I would love to take on some Seekings. 
Uh, Goldings? Goldings. Goldings will do. Um, let's go, Goldings. No, where are the Goldings? There's a Goldine. Come on, get him, Bayleaf. Yes, nice. All right, uh, Magical Leaf. I want to see what spells better. Magical Leaf or Razor... He just confused me. He did. Like, come on, Magikarp, man. <sighs> All right. It just... Did I say Magikarp? I meant Goldie. Jeez. Brain fart. All right. This is going to put me in the water if I battle him. And it's going to put me in the water. Dang it. I hate that. And I'm in the water. Great. So, yeah. It looks like Magical Leaf is just a better move. Uh, can confirm soon. Oh, they're about the same, actually. Weirdly enough. Um, about the same. 25. Awesome. Uh, now I need to get out of the middle of the lake. Uh, can I do that with... This is my strat right here. Break on top of me, go. Oh, just... Just got out there. Cottony looks shiny for a second. Um, Alright. Uh, there's that Poker Center that we've been using all episode. Uh, some Rhyhorns would be really good to level up on. Oh, right on. This would be good. Alright. Um, let's go. Okay, 48. Jesus, we're switching out to Scizor. Um, a nice metal claw here should do pretty good. Um, yep, no, that's good. Pr yeah, that's just as good as like what M Vacuum Wave would have done, I suppose. Um, so there we go, and there's our money. Bay leaf, natural gift. No, that's bad. 27, not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Um, there is some coal down here. Um, unfortunately, guys, I know I said last episode I was doing a live stream. Unfortunately, we didn't get time to go on our single player series, so don't worry, you didn't miss anything at all. Um, on that regard, but uh, it was still good. Still a really good live stream. Had lots of fun, although it was a little shorter than I wanted it to be because uh, lots of the other guys needed to record a battle dome, and I was like, I set up the battle dome. It was really fun. That mod battle dome that I uploaded yesterday, it was really good fun though. Um, using the Balkans weapon mod, really good fun. Um, I suggest checking that one out. But uh, yeah, I think we might wrap this episode up there, guys. It's been quite a decently sized episode. I hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did be sure to hit that like button below uh really great to have your support on the series like i said at the start of the episode and uh yeah hopefully see you tomorrow with another episode i'm not too sure i'm thinking of switching between kanto and uh kanto and this between like pixel episodes but we'll see what happens so yeah guys see you tomorrow and uh yeah have a good day